this just might be where I choose to quit ranked because if you guys didn't watch the last video, I got exactly what I wanted out of ranked. So now, at this point, I have nothing left to do in ranked. I don't really feel like pushing up. I mean, I could do it, so I might not quit ranked, but I might take a little break, all right? So I might post like slightly different things here. So high safe zone, classic, where's, where's Colette? She's already banned. Well, 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 I should have been Brock. <laughs> Whatever. I don't know. They, like, I, I just, I cannot mentally put myself in a rank every other day. It's just, it's not my thing. But besides that, today we have a, I don't know if it's a story. It's like a mix between a story and also just a life lesson. But how about first I actually focus on choosing the right brawler here. So last time... I picked Angelo, I believe, in my last video, so I could just do that again, I mean. Leon? Really? I mean, Leon is good, like, everywhere, I suppose, so I guess that would be good. But against that team, they have Crow? Like, my guy really wants me to play Leon. You know, I'll do whatever you say. You are Papa, clearly. I am just a little boy. I'll do Invisiheal. Sp damage and yeah okay well guys today we have a life lesson it's kind of like half half a life story here but also a lesson about how drugs can fuck up your life now i personally have never done any but uh i since like third grade which would make me like 10 10 or less years old like i was a, i was a little kid uh i met this other kid in third grade and we became best friends like we were we would hang out constantly it was that kind of friend like the the kind of friend you could literally tell anything to you could say anything you guys just do everything together L literally like textbook best best friend uh yeah so we were like that like we were best friends for for a really long time i'd say what like at least 5 years it was up until Maybe not, I don't know, it was, it was roughly five years until, um, we went to different schools, basically. And he got a different friend group, I got a different friend group. And, dude, after that, everything changed. Like, we would still try to hang out every once in a while after we switched schools, because, you know, like, we were best friends, we would hang out constantly, right? But, something started to change about him. And it was because of the new friend group that he got. Like, me personally, I've never really been into, like, drugs or drinking or anything, like, really bad. So I never, I just never did anything like that. And, you know, I'm just chilling. But the friend group that he got into in the school that he swapped to was, uh, just purely bad. Like, it was all that stuff. And he completely changed as a person. And then he fell off the face of the earth. Also, we are smashing them right now. But, so, I didn't hear from him for probably, like, two or three years. Completely gone. No contacts. He had no socials. Literally nothing. And then randomly, I'm not going to name him, by the way, because that would, that would be really bad. But randomly, he left a comment on one of my videos saying, like, hey, it's me. Do you remember me? Like, add me on this or whatever. And it was him. Randomly. I don't know why that happened or when or <laughs> it, 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 this was also a while ago like this is a span of like 10 years in total and I haven't spoken to him in like two or three years now but yeah so I reached out to him and we talked literally once and he basically told me the entire saga of what happened with him in the last like three years that I never spoke to him which was it was so crazy. So I had no idea he was even doing drugs or anything because he just kind of fell off the face of the planet after like we kind of we kind of like fell off a little bit as friends and then he fell off the face of the planet. But I didn't know why. Maybe I, I just thought like maybe oh he just he just doesn't like me anymore or whatever. But he he straight up forgot like everything. Like it was <laughs> so he. After he kind of, we, we fell apart, he uh, started getting deep into drugs, deep into drinking, at like the age of 15-ish, by the way. 
which is crazy. Don't do that. It is, it will fuck your brain up, bro. It will just destroy you. Uh, so, eventually, after doing this for who knows how long, I don't know, but he got, like, so deep into it that, uh, he got, like, so drunk or high or both or whatever that he just found this kid from school, he knew where he lived, uh, and just broke into his house and started stealing everything. He eventually got caught, I don't exactly remember how, remember, he told this story to me a really long time ago, but, who do I, just so that nobody picks him, whatever, I'm gonna pick Belle, because Belle is really fun. So he broke into this kid's house and just started stealing everything, he was like, drunk, off the wazoo, high, crazy, like, he probably had no idea what the fuck he was doing, and he got caught, and then he got put in shelter care, because he was still a kid, and it's, it's not like juvie, but it's like, uh, place to like keep misbehaving kids moderated i think it's kind of like it's kind of like prison but for kids in a way i don't exactly know what it is i've never like done insane research on it but he was there and basically he had to stay there so it's like it's like mini prison um for for breaking into somebody's house and stealing stuff randomly just out of nowhere and then eventually I gotta, like, run this all in my brain, but I'm pretty sure next he, like, broke out after a couple months of being there. Broke out. And immediately, instead of going home, resorted to stealing more stuff. I think he said specifically just, like, out of people's mailboxes. He just went around thieving from people's mailboxes, and eventually somebody called the cops and he got caught and brought back. Like, that's, that's just so crazy to me. Um... Hello. Wait, that Leon's name is I'm not Charles? That's me. That's literally me, but you're not me. Then. You're not me. You'll never be me. Oh, come on. Let me show you how it's done. Say, so, he got brought back to shelter care. Uh <laughs> And then this is the worst part. Since he didn't want to break out again, he tried to kill himself, which is really bad. That's horrible. And it sucks that it got to that point. But he failed. And because of that, he got brought out of shelter care and put into a mental institution. Uh, and only after he got out of the mental institution did he reach out to me. And then told me that whole story. This Leon is so annoying, bro. This <laughs> I'm not Charles, you're clearly him. Like, you're clearly- you clearly are Charles. Like, that's the problem here. Like, <laughs> that bro is so insane. But yeah. I really wonder, like, what would have changed if... Bro. Please. I really wonder what would have changed if we just went to the same school and stayed in the same friend group, you know? Like, what would have happened? Would he have not, like, touched any drug or any alcohol? Maybe he still would have. As kids, though, him and I, like, you know, we always talked, we were always hanging out. And we made, like, a... A, a, like a little pact like hey we're, we're just we're just gonna stay out of the bad stuff we're not gonna do that I never did it ever and he clearly forgot about that I never forgot about it I still remember about it he never forgot though and uh yeah that that all happened and that is just like case number one of why I'm just never gonna do it I don't even drink and I'm 21 I can legally do it the most I've drank is one drink I've never been drunk before I just don't want to. I've had- I've known too many people in my life who got so fucked up because of doing drugs and out and drinking alcohol that I'm just never gonna do it. Please! Please! Dude! Let's go! Okay, it's overtime. We need to, like, focus up. I don't have super. Okay, hold up. That crow might be dead. Oh my god, I'm- I'm tapping! Oh no! Yes! Dude, I'm tapping! Dude, I'm insane! Holy shit! I thought that was round two! I'm fucking crazy with it! That is insane! That hypercharge actually helped so much too. I just realized it's quick fire, by the way. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Why do we have a BB now? Like, what? Now, I'm, now that I'm seeing it, like, they have a, such a good team for this, and we have a t horrible team. Okay, my taps are gone. 
hold up, maybe not. Glad you ain't my kid. Ah, oh, fuck. Yes. You messed with the wrong mom. Ah. Uh, oh. You're dead. You're done, kid. Yeah, BB's actually horrible for this because she has to wind up. Okay, nice. I'm just gonna get rid of that. Oh, come on. I'm tapping, but I'm hitting their invincibility shields. Yeah, I've just had so many bad experiences with other people doing drugs and drinking that, like... That, that entire life, that entire story is just, like... A big thing, like a big lesson to me specifically of why I'm just not gonna do it. And I know that, like, you know, some people just do it in moderation, they don't do the hard shit or whatever. And that's fine. But I just don't feel like doing it at all. Because of that. Because of all that. So I'm just never going to. I don't see any reason to. Oh, that... That was such a score. The pass was there as well. That was crazy. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's just... Oh, my God! Now I'm the idiot. Dude, I thought... I thought I was dead. I'm gonna be honest. I thought I was just done. Okay, I outrange everybody, so I need to really use that. Except for Spike. He... Yeah. That's... I'm terrible. No way. Why is this man able to just walk past the whole team? Like, without any trouble. There was three brawlers blocking him, and he could just walk through us. That's crazy. He's been doing that this whole game. Oh my god, I should have remembered to ban this brawler, man. That's so insane. Like, that's so broken. How did he not get a nerf? <laughs> Are you kidding me? No brawler should be able to do that that quickly as well. Oh, we're tapping. Oh my gosh, wait, my, my thing that moves the shit is is popping off. It gives me ammo, I think, right? He's dead. Dude, I'm still tapping. Come on, guys. Let's just get a move on. Oh, shoot. Okay, this guy's actually a juking god. Like, he's actually him. I cannot hit that guy. Oh my god, dude. Leon is insane. Yeah, that's a score. What the hell, dude? Leon is so insane. What do like? What do we do? I actually don't think there's anything we can do, except for super that crow. Oh my gosh! It's just so over. BB, what is going on? Get over here, man! Dude. Okay, okay, sure. Like it was the Leon, but like, what? What the fuck? What is that? 19 and 8. Oh, uh, bro. Okay. I got spiders. I got this. That's all we really need. We just have to annoy the shit out of them and then hopefully win. They have a really good DPS brawler with Jesse on the safe, but besides that, I mean, they don't even seem to have like that much of a heist team. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, wow. They just used triple hypercharge. All right, you know what? Come here. All right, spiders, help me out here. Help me out here, spiders. Come on. Ah. Okay, we won round two. Spiders. Okay, that's all right. Uh, more spiders. Cool. Okay, I have hypercharge. Let's go into this. Super her. More spiders. Okay. More spiders. <laughs> More. Oh my god. <laughs> what? No! Wait, wait! Yes! <laughs> what was that? We shouldn't have won that. I feel like they had a way better team. Our Cordelius was kind of cooking though. And that, that right there ladies and gentlemen is the story of why I will probably never do drugs or drink too much alcohol. I, I have more, like, there's more people I know or have known that have, like, just had really shitty reactions or have changed to be really shitty people or whatever because of it, because of either of them. And yeah, so take this as a life lesson. If you're already doing whatever, just don't do it too much. And if you aren't, then just be make good choices all right that's that's basically it don't fuck yourself up too much and uh yeah that's gonna do it see you guys later be
uh, say 